update. Let's see Harris Rotman. <laughs> Hello, sir. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good. It's so funny because we met briefly that one yeah. time. So very briefly. And now we've got, we've got Harris here. Nice to see you all. <laughs> it's been another week, and I am sitting here with Harris. Can I use your last name? Yeah. With Harris Rotman. And he, it's, a great, it's a great last name. He is our big donor, the one that put us over the top. He donated to actually appear in episode 9, and we've, we shot your thing already. Yeah, and I'm on the street now after making that donation. I didn't you know, yeah. have enough money to keep room and board going. That's right. Luckily, you have a room for the night, because that was part of the That's the whole reason I came perk. out here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But when you get back home, I'm it's in trouble. home yeah. in quotation marks. That's right. What was it like coming and shooting your thing? Uh, it was awesome. I, uh, it was uh, everything I, I actually thought it would be. It was great meeting the the cast and crew I worked with, and you were great, and I had a lot of fun, and it was uh, worth coming out here. Was it what you thought it was going to be like? Uh, it's neat to see how it all gets pulled together. That's what I will say. <laughs> uh, all the equipment and the multiple shots. It's because um, even being around here and seeing the scenes that you shot and then seeing what they look like. It, 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 I was commenting. He's offended. Everybody, most people, one person came in and said it looks smaller on the show. Okay. I don't know what. They there might, were drugs. Yeah, yeah. There might have been drugs involved, but like um, he was just commenting. We just walked through the apartment, and he was like, "Yeah," and I'm telling him wide angle lenses. Like if right. you. We've shot scenes in that bathroom, like in episode 7, and we shoot some for episode 9 as well. Yeah, it's amazing. And you would not, you, there's no way you should be able to shoot any scene in that rest, that bathroom. This yeah. is a small apartment. It's very nice, but it's it's his room in the show is a crawl space. <laughs> it's a real, literal crawl space. Jonas's room is our crawl space, yes. Yeah, I'm not saying you can stand up in Jonas's room. And I've never seen him stand up. <laughs> I would show you some of Harris on set, but it's kind of spoilery. Right. And we've done two shoot days, and I usually do a first shot, last shot in the update where I kind of show them what we have been shooting. Right. Um, but both instances contain what I would consider spoilery visuals. So instead of like blocking out the whole screen with spoilers, I'm just not going to show them to you right now. It's going to break the internet when it gets broadcast. When you were like, it was interesting to see... Does that mean it's n it was different than you thought the filming process was? No, it was it was um, what I hoped it would be because now I want to try to be an actor. I thought it was so awesome and fun <laughs> that I need, to, I need to find a way to quit my day job and, and do this. Sure. So sure. Well, then you get to surround yourself with uh, like lots of clutter. Yeah. You know, all the time clutter and uh, homicidal Jack in the boxes, yeah. Jurassic Park figurines. You know? I am frightened being in this room, but I'm trapped here for the night. Once you become a donor. You can't get out. You're stuck forever. Harris first saw the show at Gen Con. Yeah. I saw what it was outside of the room, and I Googled it. I had no idea. Unfortunately, I'd never seen it before, and it looked interesting, so I came in, and I sat in the back and watched. I was super impressed. And then I, you know, I'm always embarrassed. I tried to get the hell out of there, and, and Jake came running up to me and gave me a button and I, so we met actually you know before we did all this and then I uh, went home and the next day I watched every episode you know and it, I was just fascinated by it. You reached out to me on Facebook yeah. and we're like hey man I saw you at the screening yeah. uh, I watched your screening and I think it's cool what you guys are doing yeah. and I was like thanks man and that was right when we were doing the fundraiser yeah. and then the next thing I knew you were donating crazy. Yeah I won't I won't bore uh, people with all the details, but I thought I was going to lose my job. My company was supposed to get bought by another company. Which is when you're supposed to donate money to like well, random uh, internet projects. It, what, what they do many times <laughs> is they, um, they, they give you money to let you go, so to go quietly into the night. So yeah. I thought, I thought my company didn't get bought, just so you know, at the end of the story. <laughs> I thought I was going to come into a little bit of money, so I just donated. I just couldn't help myself. That was, is incredible. Yeah to me. And I yeah. feel so guilty that yeah, you're not out of a job. Yeah, I really, I, I mean, it all fell apart. I, I, now I'm gainfully employed. <laughs> it's well worth it already. It's been so much fun, even just the half day I've been here. When I got the news that you had done the donation, yeah. I was just gobsmacked. And I felt as nervous as I felt since the, when we got the, our very first donation ever. I thought, oh my god, people are putting their hard-earned money at our dream project, you know? Like, our little fun fantasy that we're creating has people's real yeah. flesh and blood money involved now. And it gives me a sense of responsibility that I want to make sure that we provide 
you know, a good show to you. Yeah. And I hope, like, that's why I was nervous when I sent you the script. I hope you liked the script for episode nine. It was great. It's so cool to see everything going on with this, and I'm really looking forward to seeing the finished product. And hopefully, uh, when you see my ugly mug on the camera in the episode, you won't shatter your uh, your uh, TV screen. That's it. Yeah, no, you did a great job, man. I, the person I was paired with was even better, but I tried to do it justice. Yeah, you were awesome. You were so good. I, I, like, and that's another thing too. Like when you offer like be in the episode, yeah. like you wonder like how's the acting gonna pan out? Worked yeah. out great. Yeah. But he's he does public speaking, so he's thank yeah. you, sir. Hey, thank you for everything. Appreciate it. Um, that's it for this week. We got to talk to the guy who made episode nine. I know a lot of a lot of you also pitched in on episode nine, but this is the guy who put us over the top. You actually wrote that to me on Facebook right after you did it. You said, "I put you over the top. See you in Chicago." Yeah, yeah that's, <laughs> that's good. It was awesome. I hope you guys uh, have a moment to. In the comments, just uh, say hi to Harris. I might have brought the quality down of episode nine. You know? No, not at all. Not at all. Pop's logo right over on his left side. And we you will can't see it. It's not there. <laughs> I'll see you in a week. Thanks. Bye.